20. Hello and welcome to the Kansas Speedway for the running of the Protection 1 400. Tell us a little bit about this track, Barney. A first time winner here, definitely not out of the question in this one. Being that this place is still relatively new to these guys, everyone is on an even playing field as far as experience here. Dale Jarrett was part of one of the tightest point battles in NASCAR history in 1997. He ended up finishing second to Jeff Gordon. And he didn't finish second by much, only 14 points. And Mark Martin wasn't too far behind either. Those last couple of races in the season are pretty exciting when a championship is on the line. Tony Stewart has strung together back-to-back -to -back top fives, and I'm sure he'll try for another one. You know, people get so concerned with wins. Me, I'll take consistent top fives all year long over a win. Besides, when you're constantly finishing in the top five, a win is just around the corner. Thanks for Frank Kimmel. Yeah, I really feel bad for those guys this season. They come to these tracks and work so hard, but they just never seem to get the car exactly right. Gentlemen, start your engine. Well, let's see how they'll line up for the start. In the front row are the Altel Ford and the 37 car. In the second row are the Rubbermaid Ford and the Kellogg Chevrolet. Starting the race from row three are the Dodge Dealers UAW Dodge and the Target Dodge. The fourth row has the Dale Jr. Chevrolet and the 23 car. Starting the race from row five will be the Team Rusty Ford and the DeWalt Power Tools Ford. In row six, we have the Caterpillar Dodge and the Dodge Dealers UAW Dodge. Starting from row seven will be the Tide Ford and the M&M's Pontiac. In the eighth row are the UPS Ford and the 26 car. Tony Stewart, the NASCAR Winston Cup points leader, will start towards the front. Starting in row 10 will be the Low Chevrolet and the Mark Martin Ford. In row 11 are the Ganassi Racing Dodge and the 24 car. In row 12 are the 28 car and the Napa Auto Parts Chevrolet. Row 13 finds the 46 car and the 16 car. The 14th row has the Cheerios Dodge and the GM Goodrich Service Plus Chevrolet. In row 15 are the 10 car and the Sprint Dodge. Starting the race from row 16 are the Interstate Batteries Pontiac and the Sitco Ford. Row 17 has a BAM Racing Dodge and the 63 car. Starting in row 18 will be the 27 car and the 30 car. In row 19 are the Square D Chevrolet and the Sirius Satellite Radio Dodge. In row 20 are the 98 car and the Singular Wireless Chevrolet. Back in row 21 we have the Motorcraft Ford and the Pennzoil Chevrolet. And rounding out the field is the UAW Delphi Chevrolet.